Hello everyone, this is Ramon and I'm gonna be your guide to this adventure called How to Create a Mobile Game Like Tomb Blast in Unity by me, Ramon Dan. So basically we're going to be creating a game similar to Tomb Blast. Here's a screenshot of Tomb Blast and we're gonna make it in Unity. We're gonna go through the design process and we're gonna make a prototype that emulates the same gameplay and uh, we'll be adding small animations, some audio and some UI transitions and uh, we're going to be adding the goal and we're going to be adding the moves limit for the player. Uh, it's going to be pretty nice, pretty simple and you guys are going to learn a, a bunch about uh, game design, prototype creation and if you are basic or intermediate or so um, in Unity programming, you will be able to see some ways to implement this um, into your games. And what do we require? Well, we need to have Unity installed. We need to have Android Studio too. The JDK, of course, um, this is for you guys when you finish this, when we finish this, you, can, you will be able to export to Android. And then we also need Visual Studio. And um, I hope you guys are interested in knowing how this uh, very famous mobile game works because it's um, what we're gonna be checking out. Also for the curricul curriculum, um, I'm gonna go over this. We have introduction set up. In session 1.1, we're gonna be getting the game, basic des description, uh, some screen screenshot analysis on how this works. We're gonna be checking that Unity and other tools are installed. Uh, for session two, you're gonna be doing some in-depth, in in-depth, in depth, I'm sorry, game description and defining the prototype scope. We'll be checking some facts about the game, designing the rules and talking about the scope. So we're gonna be enumerating the rules in session 2.1. And then for session 2.2, we'll be doing the prototype scope and the possibilities that we may have during this short uh, prototype development. Session 3, we're going to be coding the game, actual game. Um, we're going to start the project in session 3.1, while in 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6, we're going to be creating the UI, the tile map, the play interactions with the tile map, the scoring, and the. Well, then we're going to do the victory conditions or I mean the end game conditions basically because it's not only uh, victory, we can also lose. And then we're gonna do a small polish run. In session four, we're gonna be doing some recap and some final thoughts um, about the whole process, the game, how to make them. And um, uh, just a little bit about myself. I am uh, Ramon, I, pro I code games for a living in with different clients around the world. I have clients in different countries. I work as a freelancer, but I also have my own game company. It's called Natural Power Games. And uh, right now it's very small, but you know, we'll, we'll be growing with that. So I hope you guys enjoy this, this uh, tutorial series and that you guys learn enough about it and you can get uh, really good at making games and then you can share it with the world especially with me. I want to play all your games So I hope we have fun and thank you for watching. I'll see you guys soon